Given w is equals to 4 minus 3i and z is 3 plus 2i, find wz and okay, find wz in form of a plus bi, hence express wz in polar form. Alright, so to solve this question, first, okay, we take the information where we have the two complex number w and z. Right, so we want to find is wz, so that's mean w is multiplied by z. Right, okay, so w is 4 minus 3i is multiplied by z, which is 3 plus 2i. Right, so we just expand this expression, so we get 4 times 3 equals to 12, 4 times 2i equals to 8i, negative 3i times 3, which is negative 9i, and then negative 3i times 2i, which is negative 6i squared. Right, so we can simplify this expression. Right, so 8i minus 9i is equals to negative i and then i squared is equivalent to negative 1. Okay, so that's mean that is equivalent to positive 6. So 12 plus 6 is 18. So we have 18 minus i. So we get the complex number wz which is 18 minus i. Alright, so next is to express this complex number in a polar form. Right, so first we can draw the argon diagram for this complex number. Right, so we draw the real and imaginary axis. And then for real part, okay, we have 18. And the imaginary part is negative 1, which is, okay, down here below the x-axis. And then at the point 18, negative 1, so we draw a line from the origin. So we get the the argon diagram so we know that the argon from the argon diagram okay the complex number is in the fourth quadrant all right so to express in polar form okay we need to express in the form of r cos theta plus i sine theta so first we can find the value of r using this formula Okay, where a and b is the real and imaginary part of the complex number so we can substitute a equals to 18 and b equals to negative 1 and then we calculate this we get r is equals to 325 and this is this is equivalent to 5 third 13 right so we get the value for r next we need to find the value of theta okay so first we need to find alpha first okay where alpha is arctangent the modulus of b over a so we substitute the value of b which is the imaginary part which is negative 1 and a is the real part which is 18 all right so we calculate this value so we get alpha is equals to 0 0.0555 radian all right so now okay we can determine theta from the value of alpha since theta Okay, in the fourth quadrant, so that's mean al theta is equals to negative alpha. So that's mean theta is equals to negative 0 0.0555 radian. So now we have the value of r and theta, so we can substitute into the polar form. So r is equals to 5 set 13 and theta is equals to negative 0 0.0555 radian. Right, so we get and we express okay the complex number wz which is 18 minus i in a form of polar form which is 5 set 13 cos negative 0 0.055 radian plus i sine negative 0 0.0555 radian